what's up guys uh back again with another video guys this time it's a video on how i prepare my used shoes and clean them up for ebay or etsy or whatever i'm selling on and uh this is the shoe that we're gonna be dealing with today it's right here see how grimy that shoe look for now all right this is my personal shoe but it needs some cleaning but uh this is one I really, you know, sometimes I prepare them the same way, you know, as I would prepare for eBay. That's what we're going to do today. And um, clean them up, try to make the best out of them. Because when you sell a shoe, and when your customer get it, you want the shoe to look good, you know. And I want to sell about anything, and when they get it, then you get a negative feedback, man. So that's one thing you really want to consider when you're selling shoes or Anything, especially shoes and any any type of clothing too. Alright guys, and some of the stuff we're gonna be using is not always about buying this high end stuff. No for us expensive this and expensive that when it comes to cleaning shoes, uh you want to try to save money. And uh here's some of the stuff that I got. I got a few more stuff, you know. I got a little bit more stuff than this. Uh this one I got here is the Kiwi the Kiwi. Shoe polish, brown, and here's the liquid polish right here. This is just made by Shoe Shoe Gear. I got here is the black. No, this is the brown shoe polish right here. Paste. Here's the black shoe paste polish right here too. And here's pink, I think, liquid brown shoe polish. And, uh... And Vaseline, believe it or not, guys, Vaseline worked for some shoes. Put your little light coating up there and kind of just wipe it back off and give it like a low gloss sheen or something like that. I'm going to show you guys in this video. It worked the same as um, the balsam stuff that they use for shoes. It's about the same thing. It's some kind of thick, greasy substance. That's all it is, guys. Okay, let's start it off here. I'm going to show you how I use this. Now, most of I done polish the whole shoe, give it a nice shake. I use the shoe like for, um, let's say, like an edge dressing. You know, like I'm going to show you, for example, this shoe right here, guys. See how the edge look around here and stuff? Now, to make shoes look really good to your buyers, make them pop. What I do, I take a little bit of this. See, just like this. Kind of go around the edges like this right here, guys. Now, this is a shoe polish, but I use it. I also can polish the shoes, but I use it mostly like an edge dressing, as you see here. Hope you guys can see that pretty good there. Now that makes them pop to your buyer. See that? Just kind of go around them edges there. Get a shoe a nice clean, really taken care of look. Just like soap. See that? Now, just a regular shoe polish, that's what I use for. I'm going to run that close up on you guys. See that right there? All right. Y'all see it good? Not give it a not worn down too much look. Run that all the way around. Just like that. Get all up in them cracks and stuff really good. And I do all my shoes like this before I sell them on eBay or Etsy. Uh, this, as you can see. That makes them look good, man. Look at that. See? Now, that what that does give a shoe not so used look. You know? 
All right, so, okay, see here. Um, now, what we're going to do, we're going to take, I'm going to show you what the Vaseline does on the other shoe here. All right, what the Vaseline does work is the same as a, that balsam stuff for shoes. I just take a rag. I, what I do, I get it out with my hand like this, guys. Don't take a lot. As you can see, about that much, all it would take. Just go a little bit out on your hand. Put it up there like this. Remember that you're just trying to make them look good for your customers. Somebody buy them, you know. And you want them to look like this before you send them out. Okay? Now take something like a, just a regular microfiber cloth or something like this right here. As you can see, it's on the shoe. Get your close view. See that? You take and kind of spread it. That's what I do like this. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. You don't really want it to have a shine to it. You just want to kind of give it a clean, natural look to it. That's what I do to a lot of my shoe. I use the Vaseline, man. And you'll see how much better this shoe look just by rubbing it in there like this. Put a little elbow grease to it. Rub it down into the shoe like it get a natural look. Then you can take this shoe and do the edge dressing also on it. And you can see how much better that shoe looks already. Somebody will want to buy these shoes now. But at first they look the kind of, uh, you know, too, too colored. Uh, whatever, you can take your screens out and, do, and repeat the process. Pull your shoe screens out up in here. We ain't going to do all that on camera. But I give you guys a good idea. That's, how you, that's what the Vaseline is for. And you can see how much better this shoe looks. Right here. Actually look like somebody wanted want to buy it, right? Okay, you come on the inner and, and repeat the same process. Wipe it in. Wipe it in pretty good. Don't get none on the sole if you ain't done it with edge dressing. You know, don't get none on the sole. Make sure of that. Okay? Wipe it in. Really good. See how good that look right there, guys? Then I like to take my shoes and put them in like a hog figure eight knot. And I also use the brush. This is a Kiwi shoe brush right here. I use that too, guys, when I buff some of my boots and stuff. Got to have a little equipment to work with. As you see, it's kind of drying in nicely, smooth. Then what I do before I send this shoe out, package it up for my customers. I take this. Repeat the process with the edge dressing like this. Well, this shoe polish, but I use it as an edge dressing because it's so easy to do with the thing on the end and stuff like this. And when you got your shoes clean like this, guys, this will attract more buyers. See that? Take that. Go all the way around. Get in the cracks really good. And this here. This will attract more buyers, man. And... If somebody buy these, they'll be very satisfied when they do. See that? Oh, you guys can see that. See how much better that shoe look from where it did at first? It looks kind of even. I ain't finished the edge dressing now. I'll just give you guys a little demonstration. But you can hit that edge dressing a couple times. 
But this is how I prepare my shoes, man. I don't send no dirty shoes and bad looking shoes to my customers. See that? Looks good, doesn't it? That's what the Vaseline works for. To smooth them out. See that? Put your nice pair of khakis on with these. Nice shirt. You set. And these is Noon Bush. It's more like a casual shoe. They go with khakis, plaid shirt or something like that. See that? Looks good. It doesn't take long for this stuff to dry up either, guys. Okay, hope you can see that. Okay, I'm going to show you here. Y'all can see how good that shoe look. Okay, sit that there. And uh, guys, here's some of the stuff. Uh, this is... Um, that's most of all the stuff that I use. Right here, is, I use the rag. You know, this is just a microfiber cloth where I apply my Vaseline with. And uh, once again, I use the brown polish. Depends on the boot. Uh, use the, the brown right here, paste. Depending on the condition of the boot, shoe, or whatever I'm working on. Kiwi right there. Got the black polish right there. And... Uh, black liquid polish right there. I use that as edge dressing and the Vaseline to smooth out things. Make the stuff look more un, you know, settled. Not so discolored. I put this on and then I buff it in. And guys, that's how I prepare my shoes for eBay. No special stuff. Find a way to make it work, man. I use a shoe brush. Got a couple of these. Also have a shoe shine box. So, you know, I got just about everything I need to make some shoes look pretty good. Put it like that. <laughs> All right, guys, let's take another look. I got the shoes drying on some newspaper behind me here. Now, I'm going to show you what it looked like first. The shoe that I didn't put no Vaseline on. Okay, here we go. Here's the shoe. I didn't put no Vaseline on. See how discolored it looked. Uneven, as you can see there. Now you see how much better the Vaseline made the shoe look. Let's get them together here. See the dark in the man? See the difference? The Vaseline shoe here. And non-Vaseline shoe here. See that? It gave a more even dark look. That's what I want to look to my customers. Now, somebody I want to buy this shoe a whole lot quicker because of the smooth texture of it. It's clean. And the soles is all done up with the edge dressing and stuff. And you can see how much better this shoe looks. Check it out. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. I rocked them with my khakis. Rocking with your plaid shirt or whatever. Just a casual shoe. Noon bush. Good comfortable jail system shoe. Something for everyday wear. Casual with shorts. And I hope you enjoy man. That's how I prepare my shoes for eBay. I make sure they clean before my customers get them. Don't send out no dirty shoes man. You know what I'm saying. So uh, yeah. Uh, guys there you have it. If you're new to my channel. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Uh, share my videos with your family and friends. Guys, take care. Get them shoes right for eBay, man. Don't be sending out no dirty shoes. All right? No matter how they look, I always wipe them down and put my touch to them. You know, it ain't nothing like my touch. Okay? So, uh, see you guys on the next video, man. Keep them shoes right for eBay now.